Marijuana is the most commonly used illicit drug and is a name given to the plant cannabis. Cannabis originated from Central Asia and is one of the oldest psychotropic drugs known. Cannabis contains more than 460 chemicals known as cannabinoids. Because the marijuana plant contains certain chemicals, some argue that it should be legal for medical purposes to help treat a range of illnesses and symptoms. The two most commonly studied chemicals in the plant cannabis which are also approved by the FDA are Delta-9 tetracannabinoid known as THC and cannabidiol known as CBD. THC is a cannabinoid responsible for the main psychoactive effects, where CBD is non-psychoactive meaning that you can't get high. CBD which is chemically similar to THC is also known to reduce nausea, suppress seizure activity, combat neurodegenerative disorders, and combat tumor and cancer cells. Did you know that our body naturally creates THC and CBD? Yes, they do. These are endogenous cannabinoids that occur naturally in the mammalian brain and body and are part of the endocannabinoid system, which consists of neuromodulatory lipids and their receptors and are involved in a variety of psychological processes. The main goal of the endocannabinoid system is to maintain homeostasis, which is to maintain a stable internal environment despite changes in the external environment. So it is responsible in keeping our biological functions in balance, such as sleep, immune system, pain, and much more. So when we're sick, our body lacks the correct balance of endocannabinoid, and that's when marijuana comes into rescue. And the phytocannabinoids, which are THC and CBD found in the plant, mimic the endocannabinoids and stimulate the cannabinoid receptors in the brain and body to restore the balance in which the body's endocannabinoids are not able to restore alone. Could it help treat patients? There is no definite answer, since it is a relatively new form of treatment, and so researchers are continuing to conduct preclinical and clinical trials with marijuana to treat many diseases and conditions, such as HIV and AIDS, multiple sclerosis, and Alzheimer's disease. Marijuana has been shown to treat pain and spasticity experienced by patients with multiple sclerosis, which is a neurological disease of the central nervous system and occurs when the myelin layers of axons in the brain are degraded causing ineffective and spastic neuronal signals. This causes the spasticity, which is characterized by tight or stiff muscles and an inability to control those muscles effectively. As a result, patients with multiple sclerosis experience pain. According to a meta-analysis conducted in 2010, cannabinoids were seen to have greater than 30% improvement in spasticity. Medical marijuana is recommended to provide relief when normal pain medicines do not work or have unwanted side effects. Canada and several European countries have approved the use of sativix, which is a mouth spray containing THC and CBD, used to release spasticity in people with multiple sclerosis. A meta-analysis reports that treated patients reported greater improvement after the use of sativix. These products provide an option for patients whose pain is not improved by traditional drugs. Even though these studies support the use of marijuana, long-term studies need to be done to prove sufficient adequacy. What are some of the risks and side effects of using marijuana? Some of the effects experienced by patients taking marijuana include getting high, increased appetite, depression, red eyes, and increased heart rate. As a result, since researchers have not conducted enough large-scale clinical trials to show the benefits of using marijuana as treatment, it is recommended that you speak to your physician about whether you should use medical marijuana to treat your symptoms and disease. Note that this video is intended to educate viewers about medical marijuana and not promote it. Thank you for watching. For more information, visit our YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook pages. And don't forget to like and subscribe.